All right, all you devils out there, happy Friday. Good Friday as well. Uh, well. Let's see here. A little afternoon for me here. Let's just probably be short and sweet here. We'll let you guys get on with uh, enjoying a long weekend. So uh, but I figured I'd just start out here at the Brave New Coin Liquid Index here. This has been kind of a you know, where, where we've gone to look at the longer term count here. It's, it's remarkable, really. Now, we're not going to spend a lot of time here because I've been going over this for so long. But just a couple of things to note here. When we were over here and we're looking at what, what was likely to come, the thing that I, I, I kept wrestling with was the idea that we didn't have a good balance between the length of time and the two and the four. So the idea when, when there was some thinking that the four was in here, I was just reluctant to put it there because it just doesn't, it doesn't balance out. So this is, I think, 260 days. If, if I, oh, shit, here, what do we got? That's uh, 260 days right here. This pivot here is is damn near one month, or pardon me, one year ago. That, that pivot high is April. God, is that the 15th? God, I think, it, are we that person? Is it, that is the, Jesus, look at that, it's 14th. So the, exactly 365 days here in this four. All right, which is why you can just feel, you can feel it from, from social media to financial news, the talking heads. There's just the general malaise of like, God damn, what happened to Bitcoin, right? It's, man, I had my Lambos ready to go. I had both colors picked up. We're just going sideways here. So the, more, the, the longer this goes, the more I lean into the triangle, right? Which is as we've been going through this, I... I you know, I'm not not to blow my own horn. It's just it's it's nothing that I, I'm necessarily. Uh, what do I want to say here, it, it's not that this is some brilliant deduction by me at all. I'm just applying Elliott wave theory. Period. Right. I mean, this is not. Th this is actually exactly what you'd expect. Ex not just kinda. Exactly what you'd expect. Rule of all. Pardon me. Guideline of alternation, right? We've got sharp correction here. Sideways, right? Oh, you can simplify this into a three, right? It's probably a WXY. Pretty sure it is WXY, but it's just a big three, right? So here we're just grinding out this triangle, right? Which is why I know you're tired of me talking about it, but there's a reason. There's a reason. The other thing is that this beautiful balance here you see is of us hitting up here into this is the 786-887 up here. You know, now, you know, I, I remember saying, boy, wouldn't it just be remarkable if we came from since we didn't get to the upper edge of the median line, if we came all the way and balanced that out over here and got 786-887 just as we did. And then now there's an abs of course, right? There's absolutely no guarantee that the next move is higher. There is no guarantee ever. I don't care what you're using, right? We, it's just market's going to do what it's going to do. We're, we're just trying to in, interpret based on patterns that we know are prone to, to repeat, not because they're magic, but because people do the same thing over and over again. Right? So that that's the foundation of Elliott Wave, right? There, there is no magic to this other than, you know, human emotion, right? Fear, greed, fear, greed. That's all it ever is. All right. So with that said, now let's... Uh, Again, I told you I will keep this kind of short here, but it is, you can just kind of feel it. People are getting frustrated. Now, this is the, you can kind of also talk yourself in, oh, shit, you know, we've been drifting lower here and, you know, all of the traditional assets were selling off, risk assets selling off, the NASDAQ's coming down, the correlation being talked about a lot between the NASDAQ and, and, and Bitcoin or just risk assets in general. So you can kind of feel that people are trying to rationalize. Now, what's the current rationalization? Well, we've been drifting lower because tax time was coming, right? So we're, what I think the last day is Monday. So most people, actually, I know I just sent mine in yesterday. So we, we got, you know, kind of the potential, or right? is this people maybe selling off some assets here to pay taxes, right? I mean, you know, you can probably rationalize it 12 different ways. But as we sit here, the, the, the reason I, I want to start here, I mean, to some degree, we, we can't eliminate the possibility here that, that because we've done a 50 here, there's no requirement that we go up and get a 618. So swing high, swing low, we tagged a 50, right? We got a target down here. There, nothing says that this, this, we couldn't have it right here. 
I, it would just be more probable, right? More, more, more. T- well, let me say it that way. More, more typical that we come up here and get a six one eight, right? And that that would give you the triangle geometry. You might, well, you'd prefer it, right? This would be a little abnormal to be that sharp here. Thus, the the thinking has always been. Well, pardon me. The thinking of late, based on this price action, has been. Oh, if that if we're going to complete an ABC here reasonable to 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 look for another leg up to get up to where it's typically you're going to find that reaction but we, we could certainly i mean this wxy could be oh, what am i gonna do i gotta hide that yeah, this that could do it all right that, that would be perfectly valid uh, you've had to do a little elliot gymnastics in here to make this work but nothing says we have to go up here i mean shit that we could do it there i mean it, E is notorious to underthrow, right? So that that could be, and we look at that with that location here in a minute. None says it couldn't be it. I'm 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 more inclined to think we've got another leg up and another leg down here, and we get right now we're going to get it that perfectly. Wouldn't surprise me at all. All right, let, let's go from this out here because this won't match, right? The the liquid index is not going to match your trading exchange. So let's uh oh let's pop over here. I've got, uh, and I'm just going to focus in on what we've got over here. I have all this count here. I've just hidden it so we stay focused over here. Oh, let's see. Let me pull out a little bit. We got, so let's get back into logs so you can see what we're after here. So A, B, C. It's right, still uh, anticipating D, E. All right, still anticipating it. Well, so you look at what we've just done down here, and I just to, for quick review, I very strongly lean into this as a three, right, which works for the triangle. Now, this has definitely gotten tricky in here. It, yeah, I gerbed on it myself last week here. I'm so determined to try and get this get get away from that truncation, but it, oh, I think you know, I, I caught it myself. Right, it wouldn't have been long before a member had caught me on it. But I, I had worked this as a five, and of course, right, we can't do that. So th thus, the truncation here, do it, does, it does fit. So ABC down here, ABC, we go into a triangle for the B here. So this gets a little tricky up for the E. Now, could we have done three here? Well, we're, we're just, it looks like a front run off the golden zone from this pivot. So what do we get here? Now, technically not a golden corner because we're not in the golden zone, but that's pretty damn close. So, of course, right. You can see how this could play out. Now, where, where would that location be? Well, you know what's there, right? I only have to draw it. All right, so right, we so we'd be hitting the median line as we hit the algo target, as we hit the golden zone from the top, right? So th thus, this move here, while you know that's as sexy as it gets from our t from, from with our methodology, that's as sexy as it gets. Now, d is that a requirement that we do this, right? Do we know, you know? It'd be, it'd be fantastic, right? So, and I'll, I'll show you some reasons to be long down here, but you know, can we count on it? Well, here, here's what I can count on. I can count on the fact that if that pivot holds, an emphasis always, 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 if this pivot holds, I got 80% odds of getting there. Now, bef before you go, oh shit, I better get long. Well, just remember, we're looking here, and where's your eye? Your eye is focused on this golden zone and that target, but let's not lose track of the fact that we just banged a 50 here that has a target down here. So couldn't you do the same thing, right? Don't Couldn't we get to create the same 80% probability? We absolutely could. Oh, God, what the hell do I have on there? Somebody else's. I want to copy. Let's go back to default there. Okay, so let me, let me, let's just, Right, be mindful of the other side, right? Always an algo on the other side. There are bears here that are in that looking for this location, right? So again, this 80% is just as valid as the other 80%, right? Just, just as valid, right? Absolutely, you can't distinguish from the two, really. So then, then it becomes a matter of, okay, well, if I can't distinguish, well, what the, how, what the hell do I do? Okay, well, so we it ultimately comes down to, okay, how are you reading the price action here and putting it in context? What would you anticipate next? Now, looking at this, 
if if you're a bear here, for, for and for whatever reason you think we're going to go break these lows and we're going, well, shit, what would that be, 27? We're going down to this range. Well, that's perfectly valid. Now, of course, that's going to change the count pretty dramatically. right? So obviously the triangle blows up, right? You've got something other than a triangle. Mm, this is going to get tricky here. I'll see how... Oh, shit. If this is going to be... Well, the most alarming account here would be, well, let me rephrase that. For a bull, the most alarming count would be if, if somehow, well, not somehow, it can be done. If this were to be one, two, right? Well, now we're going dramatically lower, right? J just to get to 100% of that one here, we're, we're well into the 20s. Do I think that's going to happen? I absolutely do not think that's going to happen for what that's worth. I do not think that's going to happen, but certainly no, nothing prevents it from happening, right? There's, there is no price action, no, nothing zero zip that prevents that from happening. So what, what, what's, what's a trader to do here? Well, okay. So if you were, okay, remember our, our focus is always on quality of the trade setup, the risk reward, right? Let's not lose track of that. And that our objective is to be profitable, not to be right about our analysis. So you've heard me say this many times, right? You, you can be right about your analysis and, and not be profitable. You can be wrong about your analysis often and still be profitable, right? I, I'm living proof of that. I'm wrong many, 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 many times, right? It's, that's not the name of the game to be right. So how can you be wrong and still be profitable, right? Well, it comes down to risk or reward, right? What are you making when you're right or when, you're, when you get the trade set up that goes to the way you're anticipating it based on all those times you get stopped out, right? Well, that's pure, that's just mathematics, right? We, we can just in our mind's eye do that math, right? Now, what, what are you making when you're right versus what are you losing when you're wrong? Well, if you're sloppy and you're dis, you don't have good money management, well, you can, you can blow yourself up pretty badly, right? And be, and be right more than you're wrong. Right, so let, let's just not lose track of, it, it, see, a, a lot of people, they, they think the whole idea with Elliott Wave is, oh, well, oh, wow, you were wrong about that count, or well, boy, you nailed that count. That's not necessarily relevant. It's only relevant if the trade was executed with good money management, the risk was managed, and you, you stayed with it long enough to hit some targets. All right, so the, the, the Elliott count is there just to, to assist, to assist in context. That's it. There is no magic, it must do this if it did that. It just not, doesn't work that way. So well, all that said here, so you can see how both bulls and bears are sitting right here can be right. Now, if you're a trader and you're focused on money management, do you want to be, do, well, let's say you're, you're bearish, right? So you think, oh, that was the correction. Oh, so this thing's going to, we're going to go break those lows. Well, do you want to be selling it right now? Probably not, right? When, when did you want to be selling it? Right here. All right, with that, that is a goal, right? It's been perfectly valid. I mean, if you're a, an Uber bear, one, two. You got you to gotta squeeze this into a five, which I think is a, I, th I think my view, right? It's just that. I think that's a force fit, right? So I think that's a three all day. And I think that's a three. You know, am I, <laughs> so does it matter if I'm right or wrong? Well, it, 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 again, it only matters. So if you, if, you were, if you took a long here or you took a short here, well, if you took a short here, are you, how are you feeling about your trade, right? In pretty good shape. Well, you, you sold it at 47 and we're sitting down, we got to 39. Well, what are you doing now, right? If you're a bear, what, what's your thought process here? Well, you just ran into a golden zone. So what are you thinking? It, well, if this is, well, let's just, let's just play it out, right? This is, this is the thought process you got to go through. Okay, well, if, if you're going to work on the assumption that this move is so strong that you're going to call it impulsive, and this is the correction. Well, where are we looking for the correction, right? 50 in the golden zone, right? So we get, we get a correction to the 50. Why would you assume, what, what would make you think now that this is no longer going here? The fact that it hit a golden zone, a micro golden zone, is that going to change your entire analysis really right you still got 80 percent to get there why, why would you change it what what 
what might you anticipate here if this is going to hold? We don't know if it's going to hold, but you can. there's a count here that will get you an ABC to get you done. So if you wanted to, to try and get that after that target, wouldn't the right thing to do here now be wait for a retracement so I can get a better risk-reward profile to try and go down and get that? Now, maybe, you're, or maybe we'll have to change that. If it does did something like that, right, if it's, we're going to head that direction, well, now I'm changing this to something. Oh, shit, come here. Oh, I'd change it. I'd start with a shift. I'd be quick to go to modify here if that looks like, oh, maybe we're doing something like that. Maybe we're doing something like that, right? We don't know what's coming. So, I mean, there's enough craziness going on on the macro side that wouldn't shock me. I'd be, I'd be very sad about it, but it wouldn't shock me, right? Anything's possible with Bitcoin. So just be mindful of, of what you're doing here. So if you thought this was the sell here, well, one choice is you take some profit, bank it right there. If you're, if you're really bearish, right, you're just going to sit and you're going to add right there because you're looking for three, four, five. That's what you're looking for. All right, we got to end in a five. Well, I got I got like, well... Oh, you could probably work that as a as a one, two, three, four, five, right? And there very very well could be another leg coming down here. I'm just accommodating the fact. That how, how could that work if I if I hold the golden zone there? Can I get that to work? Well, just as easily I could turn that into a one, two, three, four, right? This could be very. This looks very four like as it is. One, two, three. That looks like a contender for a four. I mean, shit, look at it, right? Is that right? A, B, C. Now what? Right? We'll we'll look at that in a second, but. If the low were in here, that's not a great start. You, what you'd be looking at here is, okay, well, maybe maybe some sort of a diag is, is shaping here, right? Diag, when you're trying to turn around the ship, that's often why you get so much overlap. You've heard me say that many times. That's what creates the diagonals at tops and bottoms. The market is wrestling with a potential trend change. But that's, you know, what, what would we have preferred to have? You know, a nice, clean impulse in that, right? That's what you'd prefer, right? Not, now you're not going, shit, what? Mm, could that be? Is that the four? Because you sure as hell would play nicely, right? Just do it like that. You bring it right down. Wouldn't have to change much. Oh, you'd probably make this your internal, right? One, two, three, four. Oh, shit, how are we going to? One, two, three, four, five to get you your third here. Nice little ABC into the four. Why not, right? So if you're an Uber bull, you're you're anticip uh, pardon me, bear, you're anticipating this golden zone is going to break, right? We're going to retrace into a one, two, or A, B, however, depending on how bearish you are, then you you're reloading here, right, for another leg down, right? Swing retrace, right? That's the name of the game, right? We never, 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 ever, ever, ever. I cannot emphasize this anymore. I still see still people doing it. Never buy a high, right? Never. How, somebody did. Buyers up here. Buyers up here. How'd that work out? Right, we talk, Well, actually, where were the buyers? Right, We could talked about this a couple of weeks ago. They were right in here. Right, They bought the breakout. Great example of why it's... I, again, I'm just going to continue to harp on it until I just know nobody does it anymore. It's just you're asking to be bent over there. Okay, so let, we, we come back down here. Okay, well, this remains to be seen what we've got here. Interesting, though, from this low, if, the, if this is going to go, so you see the count here, right? so we, we have to truncate here. So it's A into the B here via the triangle, and then we're into the C here. So the, the one possibility here is that we're done and we're down we go. The other possibility is that that's an ABC into a W. We're working on the X. We got an ABC to get, to get us into the D. Oh, shit, I've got it somewhere, but I'll just draw it again. So W. X, Y is what you'd be after here on the assumption here that we're at a location. Well, you can kind of, oh, I got this thing. I don't really like that. Let me, uh, let's get rid of you. I prefer it. No. No outline. Oh, what was I trying to get to here? Oh, look at all this cluster here. All this chop here, we st we stayed, we stayed, we stayed, and then we launch. Now to come back down to it, it's not not terribly surprising. Not terribly surprising, but you know, if we're going to come down a little bit further, it's still it could play. You could still get an X down here. There's no requirement that we hold the golden zone here. We could come down here and get get the no shit, get the five that way. Now what does start to happen here? You'd start to go, oh shit, boy, you're stretching the a the the length of the C relative to the 
A starting to get a little stretched, right? So it's it's not that we never see it. It's not that that's not something that the market does. It would just it reduces your confidence a little bit in like shit, man. That's a big C relative to that, but A, right? How much do I want to? How aggressive do I want to be there? So there's going to have to be more there because already it's a little bit. Jesus, what is that? Two six one A. What's well, just out of curiosity? What do we got there? Two two seven. I mean, that's a pretty good rip for the, for the C, right? Not not out of bounds. It's not like we went three six one eight, but it's it's enough to where you might think, hmm, okay, well, I don't I don't love the structure, right? So I mean, we don't market doesn't always give us what we love, right? Most of the time, certainly in Bitcoin, it doesn't, right? It's going to make you work for it. Is that enough, right? Well, so again, let's uh, let's dig in there. Oh shit. Oh, what's the best way to do this? Here? Let's go to um, let's go to a two hour here and see how we look. Oh, that might not be enough. Okay, A, B, C. We're getting all right. So you get the idea here. Well, let's go down. Let's go down a little bit lower. So with this now established here, I'm just going to take that off. I'm just going to hide some of this stuff. Well, so let's let's take it from the bull. Well. I'll show you why I suggest that we look at it from the bullish side. Well, first, the, the account implies that whether we're done here, or we've got another leg down here, and this is going to play as the four, right? There'll be some, oh, we'll, we'll get there in a second. But it's, if this is going to roll over and we're heading down here, again, we, we aren't invalidating. We, we could easily come down 786. We could come down some of these lower FIB levels here and then go up for the Y. I think I'm gonna go 60 minute here. Let's let's dig in here a little bit. So let's. Oh, I don't want to do that. Let's put the off here just for the time being and leave it here, right? So the possibility here that the X is in here, you see the slight front run on the golden zone. All right, so not much trouble with where the trend is, right? So certainly in the short term, right? Just look at the Vegas wave, right? I mean, we we flipped it right here, right? A nice swing up. Right, Vegas wave flips, down we come. Oh, can we get that done? One, two, three, four, five, that's good. Okay, so again, possibly, possibly you've got some sort of a dyad going in here. Right, let's be a little more precise about it. Let me get even zoomed in a little bit more. Okay, what's going on down here? Well, a couple of things we can see. One, this, these, these are all wicks, right? So this is the lowest close over here. So this is actually the lowest low over here, right? This is all wick structure here. So if we're looking at body closes, where, where's the lowest low? It comes in right here. Oh, now we've had, now well, we just had a little pump here. So this, this action here, it's, it's a, this is a bit of a struggle here, even though you've got a lower low. So you actually could go one, two, because this is actually just slightly lower. So you, you could work a one, two here. So how would you, how would you count this as an elitician, right? Well, the only solution here, if this is going to be three, four, we need a, a five here. So you'd be looking for, oh, and it's, it's, it's kind of harsh. You'd be looking for something like this here to get into a diag. So this pump's going to need to come pretty soon. I mean, certainly, we, well, the last stand here, we wouldn't want to see it threaten this low, right? If this is if this is going to go here, and you're seeing signs of it here, so we just had a little pump wick. Uh, so you got a couple of things to consider. Well, for, if this is one, two, three, so you you might look at that and say, okay. Why do we stop here? Well, so of course the first thing we're going to do is measure from the most from the most recent pivot, right? So let's just go down to the low here. Okay, so if we're if we're from this swing here to th this is my lowest low, and we start working on wait a minute, this is going to confuse you here. Let me hide that. All right, so this is my low here. C could this diag be coming? Well, it's, again, it's ugly, but it's certainly possible. You can't you can't pull it from here, right? We're well we're well beyond. Well, I mean you can, right? So but that that you're well beyond where the algo is going to be responsive here. So you have you have an algo that's participating here, right? With a target down here, let's call it 38. So if this if this rolls over, you can see, oh, okay. Well, I got one algo here, but we just had this little pump wick. I don't know if you guys were watching the market. We just had this little pump wick. So you look might look at that and go, huh? What's say, boy? It looked like it was going to go. Well, why why did we stop there? 
Why? What happened? I, well, you don't, you don't, you know where I'm going. Why do we stop here? Golden zone, right? I'll go fires, right? So now, of course, that doesn't mean that it can't get through, but you can understand here when you see that pump. That, that's why I, I, you, you, I continually tell you, if you don't know where this is, if you aren't tracking it, you are walking through a minefield with blinders on because you'll, you'll go, oh, it's pumping. You'll, you'll buy right into it. People do it all day long, right? Because they don't know it's there, right? They don't keep track of it. I would tell you, right? Number one, first thing, where's the algo, right? Where's Waldo? You know, he's in there. On both sides, where is he? If you're not tracking him, you're you're foolish, right? If you've seen me do this, I've probably shown that over. I mean, easily over ten thousand times. Yeah, I mean, to the tick pivots, right? If you've seen me do this and you aren't tracking that, I I, I don't know what to tell you, man. That, that you that's just foolish, right? Why why would you not? It's not it's not hard. It's not hard to track it, right? Find your pivots, right? And look, you'll find it. It's it leaves footprints. Oh, what do we got on this side, right? Oh, this one here is too much, but this one here looks like from this pivot, we came in, we tapped, we got just below the 50, right? We got to and through target and ran through that. You just, you have to know it's there. Right? You, you just have to. Gets you right on that pivot. Boom, straight, straight shot into a golden zone. If you think that's random, you're not paying attention, man. There are no random pivots. Okay, so let me, uh, I guess shit, what else do I have to say here? I don't think I have much else to add, All right? So that, oh, members, I'll post up some of the new content here for us. Some of the market structure stuff we, we've introduced lately. So uh, I'll probably do an update on that tomorrow here based on, well, let's see what happens over the weekend. I guess we can get rid of that. Okay, so... Now it's a hurry up and wait, right? I really, I really think so, right? So it's, it, you, if you wanted to be on the sell side, well, you missed your shot right here, right? That, that was your chance to sell it. Or if you want it, okay, so look what we have here, right? We have a series underway, All right? So one, two, two big fat targets down here. Both of these, right, now in play, right? So we have one algo firing, a second algo firing. So you're in the midst of a series. So for this to turn around, we're going to need some uh, trading view. Right, we got to go up and we got to get that five right now. You're looking for something significant here to try and stay in sync with the with the diag geometry. Now, you know, the purist is going to want to go up and tag it to the tick. I'm not such a purist, but I, I certainly want to see this. Well, we're not going anywhere until that gets broken. Right. Well, first, let's break the, the micro. You got to break that one. Then you got to break that one. Oh, but that won't be all that has to be broken. Right. And we got to go to that one. And we got to go to this one and this one, right? So a long way to go before we are in the clear of all that algo resistance, right? They're just sitting there, right? They don't give a shit, right? It's just a piece of software. There's no guy going there. Oh, I got you. I'm going to sell it now. It's not how it works. Something like that here. But then at the very least, oh, 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 maybe I got my five here. Well, now what are you doing, right? You just now, you're, you're not... <laughs> Okay, we're not buying it here or here. We're not doing that, right? We wait. We're retracement traders, so we wait. Oh, okay. Confirm the five. Well, now. Now we buy it. All right. Uh, oh, shit. I think that's all I got today. All right. This is kind of interesting to see how this goes. Uh, it'll be interesting. That I think that will give us um, a little bit of sense of, okay, we're, we're breaking some of this sell side algo power here we got to break them down we got to break them on the way to get to that five here and then you're going to start to feel better about this as the pivot maybe we're, maybe this is abc we're to go up and get the d right as we just we looked at ad nauseum here so if this is the x we got to get there in an abc right this could very well be a you know, big, a big rip here will give us the a b c up we go we get that d then we're down here again we're just back here waiting 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 patiently oh shit where'd you go right waiting for this to come in over here right so if we can back, get that beautiful balance here oh man i'm well i've been waiting for a year for it to get here All right dry powder prepared i'm prepared to go hard there but that's me, right? You got to make your own decisions there. But if, if we come into this zone down here and we do, and well, I would prefer that we did it 
up here, right? And then we and then we came into the E over here. I would prefer that. I don't know that I'm going to get it, but if it gets in here, I, I'm that's an all in for me. Okay, um, I think that's all I got today. All right, guys. So you guys have a good uh, good weekend. Um, what are we doing? I guess we'll be back on Monday, right? Live stream on Monday. And uh, we'll take it from there, right? So I'll see you guys on Monday. Enjoy the weekend. Hope you get a little something out of this. Uh, it's kind of a short, oh, shit, 30 minutes. Well, that's short for me, 30 minutes. Okay, good. You guys have a good weekend. I'll talk to you on Monday.